Hey guys, today I saw a video on Twitter that amazed me. Someone created a subway with movement all around it so that you felt like when you're in the subway, you were in a moving car. So today I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that movement effect. If you guys find these tutorials helpful, please leave a like and a comment and subscribe to the page if you haven't already. So I've created this little situation that feels like you're inside of a spaceship. Um, it isn't too grand. I didn't put a ton of effort into it, but it will do for this tutorial. So everything you'll need for the tutorial is a little situation with windows. So you feel like you are in a vehicle or you're in something that's moving. You'll need a fan. I'll probably use this fan for this tutorial and then you can use an airstream. You can also use the particle effect, but it kind of looks like you're moving a little slower. So we're going to go ahead and grab one of these. And all you're going to do is rotate it so that it is going, we're going to be going this way. See those streaks? It almost feels like the Millennium Falcon, like that blue streak going by, which I really like. And then before we do anything else, I'm going to go down and put a barrier underneath and I'm going to change it to box hollow and make sure it's enabled all barrier width 100, 100, or you could put it a little tighter around your ship. And then we're going to go all the way to Nebula. So already, honestly, if you just had this, it has that simple effect of how it looks like you're moving in space. The only problem is like the background doesn't move. So what we're going to want to do is grab one of these guys and place it right there. And now it really looks like we're moving. Um, that green dot is going to bother me a little. So we're going to move that in right there so that you can't see anything. And look, there you go, you are moving. I'm gonna do the other side with this guy really quickly so you can see the difference and see how it gives that movement. And then you're gonna grab one of these guys and we're gonna turn it this way. So what you're gonna wanna do is make this super high cause it's not even, it's not just stretching the actual item, it's stretching the stream too two times yes so if we take what we did on that original side and then add these gusters too it straight up looks like we're moving in hyperspace that is so sick but yeah I know this is a short tutorial but it's a pretty easy one to do so thank you guys so much for watching if you guys haven't already please hit that like button and subscribe it really helps me continue to do what you do and if you have tutorials that you want to see go ahead and put it in the comments below mm -hmm.